Say hello. Hello. And what are you going to be? I'm going to be a snake today. Okay, we're going to make Logan a snake. Um, Mandy Arlene, I'm here, and we're going to make Logan a snake. And this is a snake design I came up with um, for, again, little ones so that we can make it very easy for them. Alright, so I'm going to start with a <laughs> number 10 brush. It's rounded on the end. I got this from a craft store. Very nice brush to have on hand. I'm going to use Wolf Brothers paints, so we're going to do green. Alright, just look back. Hey, just back. Okay. Okay, top. Alright. Oh, that's what it is. Is that better? Yeah. Okay. Logan's got a mirror. Alright, so I've got two colors. Green, dark green, light green on my thing right here. So I'm going to make the snake's head here. And I'm going to bring it around to right here. And I'm going to reload the colors. Bring it around right here, and I'm going to kind of put the snake sitting in a pile right there like that, and I'm going to flip just a little triangle right there to kind of give the snake a little tail. Alright, so here's my snake, and put some eyes on him, get all kinds of cool stuff going. So I'm going to get Wolf White on my brush. I've got just for this a number six round. Um, brush and I'm going to do two eyes on the snake right here just make circles and then I'm going to do two teeth like that a little point here and I'm going to put a little thing here and that's going to be the snake's rattle oh a rattlesnake? yeah a rattlesnake that's right I love rattlesnakes. I love rattlesnakes. Dangerous. They are dangerous. That's right. But I still like them. All right. Because it has the rattles on the end. The only other color I'm gonna do is I'm gonna flip a little snake tongue there. Just go ahead and get that over with. You can do that later too if you want, but I just get it over with. All right. So I'm mixing the black on there. A little, black. a little bit of black. All right. So I'm gonna go ahead and give this snake two round eyes here. Go ahead and melt them. Give them the nose. And outline the fangs. Fangs? What are fangs? The teeth. Oh. Why do you call them fangs? Fangs? So there's snake eyes, fangs, and everything. And come down here. Give the snake. Not in my eye. On your eye. A body here, like this. Okay. And since this snake is in a pile, like a coiled up snake, I'm just going to go like that to make the coiled up part look authentic. Then I'm going to come up here and do snake's tail and just put a couple stripes on that to make it look like that's the rattle. You can even put a little movement on it to make it look like that rattle is moving. And then the other things you can do is you can do like a zag pattern if you want to give this snake a little bit more character. You can do like a V-like pattern. See now it looks like the snake's some kind of pattern or something. You can do yellow there. Yellow is always good there. And that's Logan's snake real quick. And say bye. Bye. You like it? Mm -hmm. Did you get a good look at it? Mm -hmm.